It is a ritual filled with hopes and dreams and excitement. And this is just not another wedding. This is a jubilant celebration of a man and a woman truly meant for one another. We are gathered here this evening with great joy here at this beautiful venue on the shore of the Ballad Lots to celebrate the two of you, Ben and Christine, and the next step in your journey together as a couple as you choose to speak aloud your lifetime promise and take your vows as husband and wife in the presence of this remarkable group of people who loves and cares for you so very much. And Ben and Christine, your relationship embodies so much. It embodies the meaning of respect and compassion, love, understanding. In this ceremony, it celebrates your oneness as well as your uniqueness. And we are so thankful, aren't we? So happy to be here today. So thankful to be here with you to celebrate your relationship as we honor and acknowledge the gratitude that you both feel to find each other in this life and to know that you are indeed going to share your lives as husband and wife for many, many years. And here is what also is true. We have incorporated personal elements into these moments, not only to celebrate the two of you, but to celebrate this remarkable group of people who loves and cares for you. And it is a wonderful experience for me to be part of this celebration here this evening. Thank you all for being here. Thank you for loving Ben and Christine and for supporting and encouraging them as they've made their way to this place. I know that some of you have traveled from nearby, but some of you have made great effort to be here today. Can you believe this truly remarkable day? Here in Seattle, it's truly just beautiful in all ways. So that makes me, if I want much, I have a sense in knowing a bit of your story and the remarkable partnership that you have created in your time together that in so many ways, you have absolutely been brought together to manifest your highest potential. You can do this far better together than you can apart. Together, you are doing one another. You are pulling in each other's gaps. You are helping each other grow. Perhaps this is why you feel so happy, so comforted, so at peace, and this is just the beginning. You have this remarkable lifetime to love one another, to relish, to play, to understand more about each other. and. The humor and the laughter that you share, just an added bonus to all of this. So in moments, you're going to go back down this very short aisle as husband and wife. And I'd like you to remember a few things, that each day it is an opportunity to reaffirm the vows that you are taking here this evening. You are completely devoted to one another. You are committed to supporting each other in all ways in your relationship, through the joys and through the struggles. In your words, we think we are perfect for each other. We didn't settle, but we held out for the people we always imagined ourselves with. And you know, each day, this is an opportunity to look at it honestly and say, you know, what is working? What isn't working? And the trust as you have that you will continue to get it right. We admire how you truly accept one another as is, how you choose to love each other fully and completely. You make your relationship a priority in your lives, and as a team, you lead with open communication, trust, and respect. And finally, each day, it's an opportunity for time, any time in your relationship, to treat it with those fun entertainments that perhaps keep it young and keep it vibrant. The two of you, you love to laugh at the small things. You enjoy tackling projects as a team. You share this love-hate relationship with Slipper cleaning products. And you think that your puppy is the best puppy in the entire world. You try out each other's hobbies and your weekly date night is something that you always look forward to. You absolutely love ballroom dancing. So Ben and Christine, you first met in November of 2009, after a few email exchanges, and within a few months, you were inseparable, and by spring, you had this general sense that things were leading in that forever direction. And in your relationship, you've had highs and you've had lows, you've experienced a lot of happiness 
and joy, you've experienced challenges and obstacles, and remarkably, the couple times have only strengthened the bond that you share. And so this evening, with much life history created, nurtured, and protected, we celebrate your loving relationship. Ben, there is so much that you love about Christine. These are your words. Christine loves me and she accepts me for who I am. I can truly be myself with her. She is confident and loving, intelligent, beautiful, and does things for no other motivation than to see me happy. She has always been supportive and encouraging in everything I do or when I need to talk something out. We take on life as a team, as equals, and are integrated and